and welcome to your daily reading for Tuesday, the 26th of February 2018, 2019, sorry. My name is Alexandra. I hope you are well. And today I'm using the beautiful free Raphaelite Tarot, which is a new deck. I love the backs. Look how colorful it is. Just beautiful. But first I want to tune in to the energy. The sun is in Pisces and the moon is in Sagittarius, so let's listen to the fire bell. The most optimistic one. Okay, I'm going to shuffle a little and I ask for energies and messages for us for this day, for Tuesday, the 26th of February 20, um, 2019. I'm going to pick three cards. The first, the second, the third. Okay, then I'm going to pick two more cards, I think, what to do, what not to do. We have Nine of Pentacles, Seven of Swords, and uh, the Knight of Swords. Okay, so we have a Minor Arcana only here. Two uh, cards, well, two Minor Arcanas and one Court card. Um, Nine of Pentacles is a suit of Earth. And swords are the suit of air, so they are connected with the mind, the thinking, the intellect. So what I see here is that um, an unexpected change of events may take place, because we start with a very pleasant card of Nine of Pentacles, which is, look at me, I have worked a lot, and now I'm in this beautiful garden, I deserve what I have, I'm very happy with it. I'm independent and uh, well-established and I love my work and I love my garden and I'm lucky. This is uh, a lucky card. So follow, follow this energy during the day. You may have luck, you may win something, you may uh, just feel well about yourself. But then, then we have something unexpected happening like a, <clears throat> a deceit in disguise you can see this beautiful person having flowers so it looks like she's picking flowers for herself but in reality she's picking the swords so there is a deceit here something something not not clicking uh, here sometimes this card indicates just uh, uh, not usual well way of thinking, something um, trespassing the usual understanding of 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 things. Mm. So there can be there can be a very creative thinking in Seven of Swords, but not in this deck. This deck is quite quite obvious about it that you may intercept being this. Uh, well-established and happy person and lucky person. You may meet someone who is rather from a from from a different world and sees from a different perspective, and it's not what it seems. I would be very careful with taking things for granted today, because you may be mistaken about something or someone. There's possible that this is not as pleasant as it seems. Especially that the next card is Knight of Swords, and Knight of Swords is a very violent energy. You can see a Sky Warrior here. Something unpleasant may happen 
something that seemed pleasant may appear very unpleasant, very sudden. This is a sudden movement, sudden change. Someone who acts before he thinks or she. It may be an unresponsible response to something. So, it seems like a warning, today's reading. I, I don't see it very often. But I would be very um, focused today. Because something may turn violent unexpectedly. You may start the day in bliss... And then something strange happens and there are lies and quarrels possible here. Let's ask for additional guidance for this day. I want to ask what to do and what not to do. What is recommended, what is not recommended. Please, pure light, the source of everything that is. Please show me what is... What is recommended for this day? What would you like us to do? And another card. What is not recommended? What shouldn't we do? What to avoid? Okay, let's see. What to do? Be a magician. <laughs> It can always be like this energy I was talking about. Uh, you may feel blissful and then you can turn into someone deceitful and attacking. It can also be that uh, mood swing, shift of emotions, of course. So I would pay attention to the abilities I have. I mean... Magician may create wonderful things, but may also be very deceitful. It may also be manipulative towards others. So use all your tools and all your, all your might that is here as this uh, lemnisket, right? The infinitive, infinity symbol. You're connected with the universe. And you can use your powers and the powers of the universe to your highest good to highest good of all living creature live live living creatures or just creatures uh, but you may also use your might to something that is not so good right so be very careful about it how do you use your force how do you want to if that's not your energy how do you want to respond do you want to respond with the same and thus it's going to grow because if you respond in the same way, then there are two persons that uh, act in a deceitful way. Or do you want to use this energy you have in a different way, transforming this situation into something else? Let's look at the second card. Ace of Swords, what's not to do? Don't fight. I would say don't fight. Don't let yourself be trapped in this energy, in this fight with Knight of Swords who is attacking I would just use my magical, well, magical, my natural forces, my natural might to, <clears throat> to find another solution because the magician is master of communication too. So you don't have to have this sword up, uh, upright and, and ready to strike. You may have it down and create out of other elements that you have and you have everything here you have a wand you have a cup you have a pentacle you have this i don't know how it is called um tetraed or something like that but it seems like a like a absolute jewel or something of great potency and great wealth and and this little uh mm, tiny globe it also looks like a jewel of some kind. So you have plenty of opportunities here. Don't choose uh, swords. So don't choose violence. Don't choose fighting. Don't choose a very strong um, 
strong uh, way of communicating. I know it's very much about making decisions and having clarity, but perhaps you don't need to put everything on the sword. It's like everything depends on how you react. Do you re react with more of the same, which is in this case, the seed lies, uh, quarrels and violence, or will you choose something else from your great potential? Because your potential, potential is really unlimited. It's up to you. What do you choose? Choose something different than I think uh, the coming back to this original energy of nine of pentacles is quite possible if you choose wisely, if you choose not to respond with more of the same. Okay. So that's the message for the 26th of February 2019. Uh, thank you very much for your time and attention. You may uh, leave me a thumb up. You can subscribe if you like. Please uh, come back tomorrow if you like it. Thank you very much. Have a wonderful day. Bye bye.